For my chemistry of dot dot dot, I chose to do the chemistry of shampoo. Shampoo is a hair care product that's main goal is to clean the hair and scalp by removing the unwanted buildup without removing too much sebum to make the hair unmanageable. So basically what I'm doing with washing hair is I'm taking some shampoo, I'm rubbing it into the scalp, but the shampoo is um, like used to make sure that it takes the bad oils out of your hair and all the dirt and grossness, but it, it keeps the good oils in as long as you don't shampoo your hair too much. Some components in shampoo are sodium chloride, sodium lauryl sulfate, ammonium chloride, ammonium lauryl sulfate, and glycol. Shampoo was also made by combining a surficant with a co-surficant, and these are the two main components that make up shampoo. A surficant is a substance that reduces the surface tension of a liquid in which it is dissolved. In a shampoo, a surficant works as a detergent to clean the hair, although it also can be used as a wetting agent, foaming agent, and emulsifier. The other component in a, in a shampoo is a co-surficant. The co-surficant is a substance that is used to increase the oil capacity. Shampoos are mainly detergents, which means they just clean the hair and make sure it gets all of that gross stuff out of it. And this is where the chemistry all takes place. Many of all of the components in shampoo help the foaming, the actual smell of it, um, the feeling of it, um, the way it can be rinsed out of the hair. Um, it can also be, the components in it also help with eye irritation um, and the acidity and the repairing of damaged hair. Some shampoos are different for different kinds of hair, just so it can be specific to make sure you don't damage, you know, if you have a special kind of hair.